This is just a quick video showing you how to fix your Steam account not linking to an existing Activision account because it tells you that your Steam account is already linked to a different Activision account even if it isn't. I'm not the person who found this fix by the way, it was this guy who had the exact same problem and this is where I found the fix. Uh, he was asking for help, Activision support wasn't helping as per fucking usual. But he has a written explanation here but it is a bit confusing, I'm not sure if he speaks English natively but it was quite difficult to understand so I'm just making this video. I will leave a, uh, a link to this post though if you want to upvote it or if you want to read have a written explanation as well. Here is a quick video of showing what that looks like just in case you're a bit confused. So as you can see we're in my Activision account right now, my Battle.net account is linked. We're going to try and log into my Steam account. Uh, this is the Steam account I'm logging into. Hit sign in and then it tells me this. Then if I log out and then log in using that Steam account to see what account is linked, the exact same account, it prompts you to create a new account because there isn't actually any accounts linked. The first thing you're going to want to do is create a brand new email account. Uh, this can be throwaway, you don't need to keep this, but you're going to need a new email just to get it set up. And then you're going to want to swap your Steam account onto this brand new email. To do this, you just want to hit Steam in the top left, go to settings, and then from here, click change contact email address, and then just go through this to swap out the main contact email of your Steam account. Then you're also going to want to create a new Activision account using this exact same email that you just created. Here we are at the end of creating the new Activision account with the brand new email we made earlier. Again, we don't, we're not keeping this account, we're not keeping the email, and this is just entirely so we can get the Gear account linked to the actual account we want it to be linked to. So from here, we're going to want to link our Steam account to the brand new Activision account we just made, and go through this whole process. So when you hit the email thing, it's going to bring you back, you just have to click it again, and then it'll let you link it. So. Here we are, we've got it linked to the brand new account and then you want to immediately unlink the account. I'm just stopping here because for some reason my Xbox account is linked to this even though I just never made it. Um, not quite sure what's going on there, but it threw me off a bit. So now we've unlinked the account from the brand new account that we just made. And then from here we want to sign into the Activision account you actually want to link your Steam account to. So here we are in this account that we actually want it linked to, as you can see my button it, and then we want to link the Steam account properly now. This time it should properly link. So you just want to go through this process once again. Again, you click link account, you have to put the code in and then you have to click it again. And there we are, now it's actually linked to the Activision account that we wanted it linked to before. And then from this, we can just change our password, not our password, we can change our email again to the proper email in our Steam account and it will all work perfectly fine. So in conclusion, you want to create a brand new email account. You want to link your existing Steam account to that brand new uh, email address. Then you want to create a new Activision account using that email address. Then you want to sign into the Activision account with that new email address and then link your Steam account to that brand new Activision account. Then once these are linked, you can just immediately unlink them, log back into the Activision account you actually want it to link to, and then it should link perfectly fine after that. Then once you've done that, just change your email back on Steam to your main email, and then everything is back how it was, but now your accounts are actually linked. Again, I'm not the person who found this fix, it was this guy, so if you could just leave an up or comment uh, here that you're thankful for him finding the fix. That'd be great. Just so the correct person who found the fix gets the appreciation and not just the person who's relaying the information.